I am Aditya Vikram Rai and today's our topic is measurement exercise 10 measurement and in this topic we have learned some topics as well measurement of length in measurement of length we have learned how we can define measurement of length in centimeter and meter because you know that we use fingers, hands, pans, cubits, feet and pace to measure length. When we use parts of our body to measure, measurements can vary. Since bunny and jumbo have different paces, they get different measurements. Therefore, we need different units to measure length. Centimeter Centimeter is a unit of length. We measure short lengths in centimeters. We can use a scale to measure short length and a short form of centimeter is cm. The long marks on the scale are 1 centimeter apart. And you know that after that, that is meter. And you know that meter is a bigger unit of length. The short form of meter is m. And we use meter to measure long lengths such as the length of the blackboard, a cupboard and a bed. And how you can rate a scale marking? Rating the scale marking, what is wrong method? Do not see the rating from any slanting position. You have to see the rating from above the mark. Okay? And we use a meter scale or a measuring tape to measure length. And now, that is exercise 10.1 you can see here the exercise 10.1 given here first question is write a length of each object you have to write a length of each object from centimeter scale you can see here in first picture the length of the pen brush is 13 centimeter and on second the length of the pencil is 10 centimeter and third the length of the crayon is 7 cm and on foot the length of the eraser is 4, 2 sorry 2 cm once again you have to look in first you have to write 13 cm because you can see when you will compare the paint brush from the meter scale centimeter scale you can see here that the length of the pen brush is 13 cm and in second the length of the pencil is 10 cm and the length of the crayons is 7 cm and the length of the eraser is 7 cm, uh, sorry 2 cm. And now you have to come on next question. Match the length of each of, each of the following with the correct box. You have to match the length of each of the following with the correct box. What you have to do? You have to listen carefully. First is the baby girl. The baby girl you can see here that a baby girl length is more than a meter. So you have to match it from more than a meter. Second is pencil and you know that the length of the pencil is less than a meter. So you have to match pencil from less than a meter. Third is comb and you know that the length of the comb is less than a meter. So you have to match it from less than a meter. On foot, there is bag and the length of the bag is less than a meter. So you have to match it from less than a meter. On fifth, there is a car and you know that the length of the car is more than one meter. So you have to match it from more than a meter. And now the next is the tree and the length of the tree is more than a meter. So you have to match it from more than a meter. One second. First, baby girl, more than a meter. Second, pencil, more, uh, small, sorry. Second, pencil, less than a meter. Third, comb, less than a meter. Fourth, bag, less than a meter. Fifth, car, more than a meter. Sixth, tree, more than a meter. Now, come on, next question. And the next question is, question number C, what is the length of each color, the correct box? What do you have to do? Listen carefully. On first there is a bed and you know that the length of the bed is about 1 meter so you have to color about 1 meter box okay and the second you can see here 
that the length of the this copy is about 18 cm so you have to match it about 18 cm box and on third the keyboard is near about 40 cm so you have to color it about 40 cm and the length of in fourth there is a bus and the length of the bus is near about 5 meter so you have to color it about 5 cm box on fifth there is a door and the length of the door is near about 2 meter so you have to color it about 2 meter and on sixth there is a rupees 20 rupees note so that is near about 15 cm so you have to match it uh, sorry you have to color it 15 cm box you can see here in first about 1 meter in second the length of the copy is about 18 cm in third the length of the keyboard is about 40 cm in fourth the length of the bus is about 5 meter and in fifth the length of the door is about 2 meter and in 6 the note of 20 is about 15 centimeter and now you have to look the correct next question that is a hot question and you can see it on your screen and what is the question let's see the height of tree A is 6 meter the height of tree A is 6 meter and what do you think in the height of <coughs> the height of a <coughs> The height of a tree A is 6 meter and what do you think is the height of tree B? You can see here that the tree B is half of the tree A. So the length of the tree B will be 3 meter. So we have to take 3 meter. Plant C, you can see here that plant C can't be 20 meter. Because 20 meter is a larger length. So that is 20 centimeter because it less than tree B okay so plant c 20 centimeter we have to take 20 centimeter plant d plant d is half than plant c so the plant d will be 10 centimeter not 10 meter okay so we have to take 10 centimeter tree b 3 meter plant c 20 centimeter plant d 10 centimeter you have to take the correct option you have to take it okay and the next one is measurement of weight <coughs> now the next topic is measurement of weight what is the measurement of weight you have to look here and what you have to do mambo said i am heavy and jumbo said i am light the words heavy and light tell us about weight and what you have to do you have to compare the two there is a question given you have to compare the two right h for heavy and l for light okay you have to compare the two objects right h for heavy and l for light okay so the next is what you have to do and uh, compare the two right h for heavy and l for light in first picture you can see here that a truck is heavy so we have to write it for h and a cycle is light so we have to write it L okay and truck is heavy so we have to write H and cycle is light so we have to write L in second the sheep is heavy so we have to write it for H and the boat is light so we have to write it for L okay in next question number third the flower pot is heavy so we have to write it for H and the flower is light so we have to write it for L H means heavy and L means light in food the elephant is heavy so you have to write it for H and the ant is light so you have to write it for L and the next one is in fifth the watermelon is heavy the watermelon is heavy so we have to write it for H and the banana is light so we have to write it for L in 6, the fat man is heavy, so we have to write it for H and the small girl is light, so we have to write it for L. And we can measure weight with the help of different unit. And uh, what you have to do in your homework, you have to do, you have to fill book 
page number 137 page number 138 and page number 139 in your book thank you